Ready. Action. Hi, I'm Avi Arad. And I'm Laura Ziskin. We're the producers of Spider-Man and Spider-Man 2, coming to theaters this July. We want to thank you fans for making Spider-Man one of the most popular films of all time. We think the new movie will go beyond the first, taking MJ, Peter Parker, Spider-Man, and our new villain, Doc Ock, to a whole new level. And now, here is a special behind-the-scenes sneak preview of Spider-Man 2. Kirsten Dunst, Spider-Man 2 looks so awesome that we had to share with you a little taste of what's to come. At the end of the last picture, we left Peter Parker deciding to take the road to responsibility. It was a decision he made that ended the film. And now movie number two is the journey itself. How will he weigh his personal needs against his responsibility? That's why I like the Spider-Man movie that we're making now because it's about choices. He gets a satisfaction out of being Spider-Man, but it's more of a responsibility that, that he feels it's really wearing on him, especially at the age he is. Doc Ock. He starts off as a really well-meaning scientist, and he takes Peter Parker under his wing, and he's invited to see this fantastic unveiling of this wonderful new process that he's been working on for years and years. And during the demonstration of this thing, something awful happens, and mayhem and Terrible retribution ensues. Coming back, it was so, it's, yeah, it's nice that you know everybody, and I just feel like I changed so much, so my relationships with people have grown a lot, and so it was like, so nice to know that I know everybody. The more people I find that I can work with, that I feel comfortable with, that deliver great artistic results, I try and never let them go. I try and always make my movies with them. The experience that I have is making the movie. So I want the people that I'm working with to be proud of their work on screen. But mostly, I do want the audience to have a good experience with the picture. The cool thing about being Spider-Man for me is that my fans are kids, basically. So that's what I love about it, because I love kids, and, and that's fun. Next to Mr. McGuire. Whoa, I'll just freeze it. Yeah, just freeze it. What about when he bends? Hey, take a look at some exclusive footage. Spider-Man and Sam Raimi are the same thing to me. It comes from him, it's his vision. Sam's very collaborative. He's always curious to have your opinion on things. What Sam responds to is like an honest moment, whether it's like funny or awkward. That's what makes Sam magical. I hope that they feel like they've been told a love story, participated in another episode of Peter Parker's life, and mostly I hope they feel uplifted. Hi, I'm Sam Raimi. And I'm Alfred Molina, Doc Ock, for those of you who haven't been paying attention. We hope you've enjoyed this special sneak preview, but trust me, when Spider-Man 2 hits the theaters, there'll be plenty more surprises. Sam and I had a lot of fun making the movie. We're trying to leave something special for the fans. Alfred, can you think of anything? Mm.